It's definitely giving wifey vibes. All I'm missing is a new ring, okay? Look, next. <laughs> it's the memory. I want to see all my people win, and we know that. Oh, you then I got you to the end, and you snow that. Everybody used to show me love. Where it go at? I was born to shine. I speak my mind and get that glow back. Try to pay my dues, but niggas rather say On my roof. Sugar in that shit. I ain't put no damn sugar in my spaghetti. I used to do that though, but I just made me some dinner, y'all. Look, look, look. I had me a whole little night, look, mini night routine. I went on here and I showered. I greased up my hey Google. Hey Google. Hey Google. I pause. I went on ahead and I showered. I like oiled up my body with some coconut oil and some lotion and whatnot. You know what I'm saying? Doing this really cute dress. Actually, it's from um, Savage Fenty. It's a Savage Fenty dress. I got it like sometime last year. You know what I'm saying? Looking cute. And then I went on ahead and poured me a glass of wine. And I got some spaghetti. I made some spaghetti. <laughs> so good. So. Me and my cousin low key having like a low key debate. Well, not like a real debate, but it's like a little debate. She likes sugar on her spaghetti. I used to do that all the time. But I don't do that no more. Cause I put jerk sauce in there. So I put like jerk sauce, jerk seasoning in my meat. And then on top, I like to put Parmesan cheese. Oh, it'd be so good. So what, what, what team are y'all on? Y'all on the sugar team? Or y'all on the Parmesan cheese team? Which one is a gift? Let me know down in the comments. <clears> Hot, <throat> huh, no damn sugar. Look y'all. Mm. It's so good. Y'all probably all look fun. Oh, and these are like pita bread bites. So I went ahead and put some olive oil on there with some, what was it? Garlic powder and onion salt and some oregano. So good. I kind of burnt it, so it's a little hard, but that's okay. You eat it with the noodles, like a little sandwich. It'll be good. You know what I'm so I'm about to get back to my, my zone. I hate funny. that. I don't know. I want to get back to my zone. It's funny when you make your videos. Baby, I need to start doing shit like yeah. that. Yeah. I let the world see your personality. I don't got no man. Yeah, exactly. I ain't got no man. I ain't got, I ain't never bored. It's always shit for me to do. No. Hey, Google. Play. Okay, it is the next morning. Actually, so it's April 2nd, and it is the start of Ramadan. I had told my grandmother that I was going to try my hardest to participate in Ramadan this year with her. And um, I'm excited, but I'm a little nervous because that requires a lot of discipline. But I figured that it'll just like help me create a little bit more structure and like a schedule for myself, um, which is very much needed because this is like the last month of the quarter. Um, this is the last month of the quarter, of the first quarter of the year. So yeah, and I don't know if you guys can tell, but I've been feeling like so much better, and like I've been just in like a different space and a more focused space. So I'm like feeling good. So I'm just like, y'all just happy. I don't know if y'all can see it, but your girl is just happy. I mean, obviously I have my moments, and there's like things that I still need to handle, but in overall essence, I'm happy, and I haven't been able to say that in a very long time. Um, so yeah, um, I'm super excited also because my sofa came. Don't judge me y'all, but I've been here for like, well yeah, I've been here since Temple. And I haven't really been like furnishing my apartment because I just haven't been in the space. So my living space has literally just been like a working studio. So I have like my um, salon station, um, my styling station, and then I have like a mannequins on the walls and stuff like that. And that's just literally been the function of my apartment. And I now want to transition my apartment into more of a functional living space. So I went ahead and I ordered me a sofa. I was way there. I had my eye originally on this sofa that was at OCB2, but when I did the measurements of the, the limited space that I had allotted for a sofa, Oh, it was too big, but it was so cute. I'm pushing close to right here. It's a really cute teddy bear sofa um, type of vibe. I really wanted that sofa in here, but it just doesn't make sense. So 
I'm gonna keep my eye on that or something similar for like when I decide to purchase a home. Okay, so I found this sofa on Wayfair and it looks so comfy online. So I'm hoping that it looks just as cute and comfy and like chic in person. So we're gonna spend this morning unboxing and trying to put together this outfit. <laughs> Super excited. And so now I can like focus on okay, like what else do I need in here obviously to make my place functional. So I'm super excited, y'all. I'm just gonna go ahead and spend my morning unboxing this and putting it together, doing a little DIY or whatnot. And um crossing fingers, it's cute, you know what I'm saying? Never had a lot, this is all I need People never care until it's all I need Niggas turn it back on me for no good reason Lord, see the prices and it's all I need Can't burn a bridge just to light my way A lot of 42 on the flights I'm taking Pouring out my soul and it might stop crazy A lot of falling outs help me build foundation Never had a lot, this is all I need People never care until it's all I need Niggas turn it back on me for no good reason Never had a lot, this is all I need Lost individuals is all I see Grab the top spot like part of my reach Woke up one day and it was all on me If it comes down, it's gonna fall on me Lot of 42 on the flights I'm taking Long way down on the heights I'm chasing Just touched down, I was lights out of Vegas Girls checking in cause my lifestyle dangerous Hard to tell people that I'm all out of favors Call me Same thing with the bed. Like, I gotta put my own bed together. It's just, that should be, them boxes be looking too big. I It's on the way the picture at all, actually. But I very much love this because I still got my semi teddy bear furniture. <laughs> oh my dear. Okay, let me finish putting this together. Nala. Bitch, if you have an accident on this motherfucking couch, I will toss you through our imaginary balcony because I don't even have a balcony. But she don't get her ass she like little fuzzy shit. Nala girl, this is a sofa, okay? So you know what your pee pee pad looks like, right? All right. Then. I'm so excited, y'all. Let me finish putting this together so I can finish my reels. <laughs> okay, so I just got finished um, not too long ago putting myself together so I'm like so excited about that. I've been literally on my computer just like looking for more pieces of furniture to bring in here to pull this place together. Well, it's currently 8.03 so I did my first day of Ramadan. The sun has set um, at 8.02 and it's 8.03 now so now I get to eat because you girl is thawed and I haven't ate or drank anything all day. And they said once you get past the first two days, you should be good. Um, I got the past day one by just like staying productive and like keeping my mind on like other stuff and I'm so proud of myself. I missed a few prayers um, so tomorrow I'm gonna really have to um, set my alarm and well okay I don't even have to set my alarm honestly because I downloaded this app called If You're Interested and in, um, participating in Ramadan it is not too late. Um, I downloaded this app called Muslim Pro. It's free. You can also pay for it to like um, read the benefits of the perks of like the other stuff on the app to have access to the entire app. But um, I just downloaded it for free, and it basically keeps you on track of like your day. So like it gives you the times on when the sun rises for you, when the sun sets for you, and the time stamps that you need to be when you need to take a pause and you need to do your prayer. Um, I did, I do want to get more into reading though. So I did order me a Quran 
and um, it has the English translations in it because I don't know how to speak Arabic. I, I was taught how to speak, I mean I was taught how to read Arabic back um, in elementary and middle school, but because I haven't been consistent with my readings and stuff, I don't remember. So I bought a Quran that has um, the English translation to it and then that'll probably help me like, um, you know, with my readings and stuff. So I ordered that, so that should be here sometime this week. And um, yeah, I'm like super excited. So I don't know, like I don't know all be all, like I don't know everything, but um, this is definitely a start for me to kind of like cleanse myself. Like so, like during this month, I'm not supposed to drink alcohol, smoke hookah, you know, things like that. So you know, um, have um, participate in like sexual activities, and that includes masturbation. So. You know, this month I'm, it is really allowing me to create like a schedule and have some type of self-discipline within myself. And I look, I'm all here for it. So they even post like inspirational um, quotes and stuff like that on the app. And I just came across one and it says, Oh Allah, give me the strength to distance myself from that which distances me from you. Um, that is something that I'm going to be saying to myself almost every day. And you can take that however you want to take it. You can just say that to yourself like okay so say for instance you're not religious or say you know you are a spiritual person and you think and you believe that you too are a god you know say that to yourself like you know oh my highest self give me the strength to distance me from those and things in which distances me from being my higher self so look i'm just feeling so good with it <laughs> I'm feeling so good about myself. I'm feeling so good about life. I'm feeling motivated, optimistic. I'm just like in a different space, and and I just ate dinner, y'all. I'm I'm not hungry, but I want something sweet, so I made me the chocolate fudge from Trader Joe's with some ice cream caramel, and I put a little raspberry up there. Mmm. Now I'm about to really feast and um, rest a little bit before. It is later on in the night, it's Saturday night, and I just got dressed. Um, I'm about to go out with my neighbor. I've never hung out with her before, so I'm so excited because it's gonna be a fun night. So it's basically just giving like a girl's night type of vibe. But, but I got this outfit from all the way back when I was in Virginia, and then I have on these pointy shoes, like sandal heel shoes, same shoes that I've been wearing, honestly. These like go with everything. So this is just the outfit. And I got on my Cuban chain from Go Presidents with the bracelet and the JVW watch from JVW. Look, I don't know. <laughs> and then I'm gonna wear my St. Perry purse. It's the rock, honey. I think I might just vlog from my from my phone because my purse can't fit my camera. No! Nala! Nala! <laughs> I just need to pull my hair right now. Oh, I think it's over. giving me grown and sexy in the makeup you know what i'm saying no eyeshadow just like a beat face 
brows, a little bit of lip gloss, and the neutral robe. It's giving what my man at. It's giving what my man at. Like, okay, look, I'm on this up floor journey, but who doesn't want, you know what I'm saying, a man? Like, who don't want a man to live all alone? Who don't want a man to live all alone? It's definitely giving wifey vibes. All I'm missing is a new ring, okay? Look, next. <laughs> I just love the spirit I've been in lately. Like, come through, rude, not Jay. Come through with the come through, okay? It's given. Thank you. Thank you, next. So, thank you, next. Whatever. Oh, what was that by Ariana Grande? Yes. Definitely giving that. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling cute. So, let me go ahead and go out here and um, record my video. Girl, you fine. Girl, you so fine. If it right for you today, girl, you can say. Goddamn day. It's, we actually skipped a couple of days. It's Saturday night, and your girl had a semi relaxing, productive day. I did um, end up getting my lashes done because I don't know if y'all noticed, but them things was looking terrible. They was barely existing. But you know what I'm saying? It's all good. That's all cool though, because my kids just about to get what they've been asking for for the past couple of months. Drum roll, please. <laughs> Take it down a little bit, man. Come on, what are you, a horse? That's the last one. I guess who in the building? Gang in this building. Guess who in the building? Gang in this building. Say hey. What's up, Kendrick? Yeah, what's up, Kendrick? <laughs> Well, Brandon is here today, and we about to go to the Boyle to get some food. I don't know if y'all saw on Instagram that it's this Boyle place that's here in Buckhead, Atlanta, that it made his first, what, three million or something, something like that? Yeah, for real? I don't know. I'm posting right here because I don't know um, what it said, but I was like, you know what? Let's just go to the bill, to the bill, to the building. Let's just go to the Boyle uh, to support, you know what I'm saying, a local black owned business. That's what we about to do right now. Now, I see and plus, I've been craving a boy. And Brandon, Brandon never went to a boy before. Never. Never had a boy before, which is crazy. How old are you, Brandon? 28. 28 and never had, never enjoyed a good old seafood boy before. So we about to enjoy a good old seafood boy tonight after he take my pictures. <laughs> <laughs>
I wanna know your name, man. I wanna know if you got a man. I wanna know. I wanna know everything. I wanna know your number and if I can come over and. I wanna know what you like. I wanna know so I can do it all night. But you're telling me I'm just a friend. You're telling me I'm just a friend. Oh, baby, you. Oh, baby, you. Got what I need. Got what I need. But you say I'm just a friend. Say I'm just but a you friend. say I'm just a friend. Cause I can be. Cause I can be. Fantasy. But you say I'm just a friend. You say I'm just you a friend. Say I'm just yeah. a friend. I wanna know you in and out. I wanna know what you're all about. I wanna know. I wanna know what makes you laugh. I wanna know about your past. I wanna know how you move. I wanna know so I can move too. I wanna know. But you're telling me I'm just a friend. Telling me I'm just a friend. Oh, baby, you. Oh, baby, you. Got what I need. Got what I need. Yeah. But you say I'm just a friend. Say I'm just but you a friend. Say I'm just a friend. Cause I can't be you. Cause I can't be you. Fancy. Fancy. Yeah. I made some turkey sausage boiled eggs. And avocado toast for Brandon. This girl. He ain't never had avocado toast before. No. So I'm nervous. Cinnamon raisin bagel and almond toast.
coasting Took another sip of the potion Hit the three wheel motion I was glad everything had worked out Dropped the burnt off and then chirped out Today was like one of those fly dreams Didn't even see a berry flash in those high beams no helicopter looking for the murder Two in the morning got the fat burger Even saw the lights of the good year blip And it red ice cubes up in Drunk as hell but no throwing up Halfway home and my page is still flowing up Today I didn't even have to use my AK I gotta say it was a good day And I'm actually about to go to my scheduled appointment at 10.30. I'm going to the sauna. Um, I found out about this sweat house via Instagram. They did like an advertisement on Instagram. And I was like, you know what, Ajay, just go. So I'm packing my bag right now. Um, and I'm just going to take my flat iron. I'm going to take a towel just in case. I got this towel from Target. So cute. I got it in brown and white, but they have like other colors as well. I'm also gonna take my comb and my edge wrap. This is for, cause I'm pretty sure I'm gonna like sweat, obviously it's a sweat house. And I'm gonna shower after, so. Um, I'm bringing my um, Journey Skin robe, spa robe, and then I'm also going to bring this head wrap cause I'm probably gonna wrap my head while I'm in the sauna. And that's it, because I'm pretty sure they have everything else that I may need. Um, my Uber is actually downstairs right now, so I'm going to go downstairs. I just have to grab my key and make sure my phones are, got some juice, they got enough juice, and head out the door. Let's go. So this is the um, sauna. You get your own personal sauna, and um, there is this like pad over here that you can control the heat of the sauna and also the music and the light. So I chose this color because it's very calming. And then you don't even have to go anywhere. You can literally just come right here and shower. So like everything is in one suite, which is amazing. So this is the shower. And they have like shampoo, conditioner, body wash, and face wash. They also have like lotion, shower caps, deodorant, and stuff. And this iPad is where, where you control your music. This is the end of me and you. But don't call this number experience um, I've been to like sweat saunas before but that one was very interesting because um, you had your own little personal suite and I mean typically I would be like in my own sauna room but this one had like the shower in there it had um, you know you can play your own music you can set your own mood set your own vibe 
So that was pretty cool. And um, someone advised me, one of the girls that go there often, and she had advised me to next time book the double suite and um, you can either bring someone, like have a friend come with you and it's only like 20 bucks um, extra, or um, you can like remove the benches out of the sauna and bring your yoga mat and do your workouts. So I was like, oh yes ma'am, I get a nice little workout in at the sauna by myself in my own little seat, in my own little room, just in my own little world. You know what I'm saying? So I thought that was pretty cool. And they have really good, um, like packages too, like unlimited. You can come, you, they have like a monthly um, membership package where it's like $125 and you can, my darn camera died, but they have um, packages where you can come unlimitedly every month for $125, which I think is pretty cool. And if you don't wanna to commit to like a monthly membership, they have um, one where you can use for the entire year. Um, I think it's like, 10 you can come 16 times within that year for like 200 and some dollars but they have cheaper like packages as well but yeah I'm like, oh, this is pretty tough and it's like right around the corner you know and it's in bucket shops so like um after you go to the sauna you can go grab you a lunch go grab you a salad or whatever so i thought that was pretty cool but on my way home i should have stopped at my virtual office because i know i got some packages um but i went to the grocery store i went to trey joe's and I like to get my meats from Trader Joe's. I go to Publix for like the stuff that I bought yesterday, but when it comes to my meats, I'd rather just go to Trader Joe's or Whole Foods. So I went to Trader Joe's and got me some um, wild caught Alaskan salmon and some ground turkey. You know, always need ground turkey around the house. And then I got my chicken. Well, this isn't my chicken. I don't even, I don't even be eating like chicken breast anymore for some reason. I don't know. I just don't want to eat it but this is for Nala so I buy Nala a pack of chicken breast every week she goes through it every week and I went to go get my buffalo dip and somebody must have ordered the wrong goddamn thing because all they had was vegan buffalo style dip plant-based dairy-free I ain't never seen this in Trader Joe's but I'm still trying it so I'm gonna let y'all know how this plant-based dairy buffalo style dip is well, on a good on a good tip, it smells the same. It actually smells the same, which is a little creepy. Dairy free, plant based, no meat. Mm. Let's try it out. I'm using these blue corn tortilla chips, organic tortilla chips from Trey Joe's. And I like these because they're dark, you know what I'm saying? I like dark things. <laughs> I forgot, it's 2022. You can become vegan and not even know you vegan no more. I'm here for it. And then I had to get my gluten-free, gluten-free because it's easier to break down in your tummy. I hate this. Gluten-free because it's easier to break down in your tummy. Um, this is my cinnamon coffee cake muffins. Love these. Oh my god. And of course I had to get my cold press coffee. This is so good. This is like the best cold brew coffee that I've ever um, had because it's so strong. Oh my god. And it's organic. And then I went ahead and got me some tamarind sauce, sweet and tangy sauce. I'm going to use this for my salmon. And I picked me up some new flowers because my poor babies over there are dead. And I was in like a yellow mood. So I was like, let me get me some yellow roses. You know, and um, that's it. So I'm about to actually, because I'm still breaking from my fast. Yesterday I had broke from my fast. So I did 10 days. No, I did 9 days fasting. I'm going to do 72 hours of non-fasting. Um, but I'm still trying to eat clean and then I'm going to go back to fasting tomorrow. So I'm going to make me a nice old salad, um, edit this video, upload it, and I'll just see you guys in the next vlog. <laughs> a more intentional vlog. This one was just like, come kick you with me for the week type of vlog. But the next vlog is going to be a little bit more intentional. It's still going to be organic, but a little bit more intentional. So if you made it to the end, you're not subscribed to my channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you can become part of the Kendra family. And to all my Kendras out there, once again, I love you so, 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 so much. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye.
So this is my lunch for today. I have some trout, shrimp, peppers, onions, asparagus, granola, strawberry, cucumber, and mixed spring leaves. And then I use this dressing, balsamic and fig by Trader Joe's. So good. And this set, this dressing is like one of my top five favorite dressings, top three favorite dressings actually. Salad is so good. And now I feast. Just a memory. I want to see all my people win, and we know that. I love you, then I got you to the end, and you snow that. Everybody used to show me love. Where it go at? I was born to shine. I speak my mind and get that glow back.